Finally, after such a long time of searching, I managed to hitchhike a sailboat across the Atlantic Ocean. It was day four of our four-week crossing to the white sand beaches of the Caribbean and we sailed into the perfect sunset when suddenly, out of the blue, something terrible happened. Okay, we just lost our mast. I set off on the biggest adventure of my life. The attempt of hitchhiking around the globe, hitchhiking cars, Thank trucks, so much, guys. motorcycle, tuk-tuks, or whatever moves over the continents, and hitchhiking sailboats over the vast oceans around the world until I reached the point where I started again. When you travel only by hitchhiking, your fate depends to 100% on the kindness and the hospitality of strangers from strange foreign countries. Thank you, Ali. Very much, And exactly this trust that you have to give to humanity lets you dive deep into other cultures where you really meet the people, while opening up the hearts of both sides. But every true adventure comes with the most intense and unforeseeable highs and lows. Dealing with terrifying incidents at sea. Getting close to the Taliban in Pakistan. Dealing with a pandemic on the road. Waiting. Just waiting for an endless amount of time. After two years of hitchhiking, I'm still not even halfway around the globe and I cannot wait for the surprises that the next adventures will throw at me.